guys and welcome back so yeah i'm gonna be working in the passion planner again today yeah you can see i've really made it far <laughs> it's been busy guys but um if you watched the other episode uh whenever i was setting this up like this is pretty much like yeah look at my day like oh god like that is seriously most of the days like 4 a.m start and i'm pretty much going to bed at like 12 midnight so it's a very long day which is why i normally don't use the uh hourly schedules just because they don't make them for people like me um <laughs> but uh, yeah as you can see like this has worked out really well I have uh, enough spots to keep track of my meals, um, a reflection area for my daily workout, plus I'm keeping tracking of my spending <laughs> in my daily habits, in my goals. Like, oh, yes, I had a cupcake, okay? <laughs> Deal with it. I needed the energy. Oh, and I just realized I didn't fill it in. So, um, yeah, let me go ahead and grab the pen. I uh, kind of need to write in there. I skipped that one. Um, I was pretty full. Like the whole Arby's thing. It just wow. And as you can see, like I napped uh, pretty extensively in the afternoon. So, <laughs> which leads us to today, which is Monday. Uh, normally, I like to have these like prepared and they're ready to go. But I was like, you know what? I think that's what I'm gonna do to start my day. And yes, anytime you see the camera shaking, that is me smacking my head off of the camera. <laughs> I love this new, like, camera setup. Like, it does, I feel like it gets me closer to the pages for you. But it's also getting the camera closer to my head. So, let's see here. I'm working in the, what is this thing called? The Fun Florals. Uh... Okay, don't get me wrong. I think it's gorgeous. Like, I like it. I think it's cute and fun. And then there's just some stickers in here, which, yay, last week I used up two sheets. So I'm just going to pull them out. Okay, so I'm setting those to the side. And then you get stickers like this. And I'm like, Ugh. like, what? What? It, like, I know there's someone out there that's like, those are the most beautiful stickers ever. And uh, no. <laughs> they're just not for me but I don't know what to do with them because you know so yeah I'm gonna go ahead because I mean this is technically a functional planner anyways so that's how I'm using up my sticker stash <laughs> like the same thing kind of works with this the fitness plan or yeah fitness planner the fitness sticker book that I'm using now like I think I got this like maybe two years ago and as you can see like I really haven't used it until I started putting stuff in here. <laughs> so I'm kind of like working myself through two sticker books that I do generally like. It's just they never end up in like my actual planners. Like my happy planners. Which is what I've technically been planning with. Passion planner comes out every now and then. Uh, mainly I keep like these little side planners. Like the passion planner. These are for those goals that I just I really want to focus on and it seems like if I incorporate them into my happy planner layout they kind of get lost with everything else so like these are more of like a focus and I'm digging these daily pages too okay like <laughs> as you can see like my day just gets like crazy and it helps if I could like track everything in all in one place and then that way I can record it or log it back into my happy planner and make it look beautiful. So this is like the workhorse of my planners. And yes, you are seeing me take the outline of those little dot star stickers that I used and I'm trimming around them very so gently and taking the knife, popping that excess border sticker off and I'm using that to circle my days. <laughs> I really do not like the way stickers and that means like pretty much anything of the book <laughs> so if you want to try to get or you know if you want to learn how to make like get more out of your sticker books uh this is the way to go 
<laughs> I mean, like, yeah, you could use the sticker itself. Then you could trim the border off. And um, I know I'm going to do it. I know it's going to happen. But I also used the white backing of those stickers as well to cover up words or areas of my planner that I don't want to, uh, you know, see through. So I know that's going to happen. I do it at least once every spread. So let's see here. The last time we did this, I went to like Thursday or Friday. But I have a vacation day on Wednesday. Thank God. Um, yeah. <laughs> so I think I'm just going to do Monday and Tuesday today. And then I will get back into this on Wednesday. So, okay, let's see here. What are we going to work with? Like, I want to use these, but it seems like you'd have to write so small. <laughs> so maybe we'll save that for, like, a later layout. Let's see here. We've been using, what is it, those breakfast, lunch, and dinner ones? Yeah. Yeah, okay, so I think I'm just going to keep on with these. Which, heck yeah, look at all those little colorful boxes that I'm going to end up having once I get this, like, taken care of. Like, ooh. <laughs> Is it sad that that's, like, what I'm the most excited over? So, alright, let's go ahead. Which, I mean, I'm sorry. Like, if, if you are someone who actually, like, do find, like, these flower stickers to be gorgeous and that, like, more power to you, okay? Like, <laughs> It is just, it's not my thing. It's not. So, yeah, I'm going to use this little strip of these ugly flowers. <laughs> Which, oh my god, like the colors of them are even like eye blinding to me. Like it's not, it's not calming, it's not soothing, it's just... <laughs> but it's okay, we're going to make something super gorgeous. <laughs> Is that like gorgeous and ugly put together? So yeah, we're gonna make a gorgeous. <laughs> I mean, parts it, it's gonna be functional, guys. Like that's really what I'm looking for. And uh, like I said, like I feel better. I feel really good when I'm done making these spreads because I know I'm using those stickies. They ain't going to waste. <laughs> Yeah, like that's the same they just like photoshopped it in oh happy planner i caught you <laughs> okay let's get on with our meals which um yeah apparently like my day gets so busy that i forget to eat so these little stickies have been helping me uh realize that that's pretty much probably why i haven't really had energy <laughs> There's been a lot of days this last week of where it's like, oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah, you haven't ate yet. You know, you should probably do that. <laughs> so, yeah, see, these actually come in handy. It's not just a bunch of stickers thrown on a page. It actually reminds you to do things that are good for you. <laughs> oh, God, guys, like, I can't get over <laughs> things like normally I don't like covering up the stickers with other stickers but you know what we might have to cover some of this <laughs> we'll put this nice yellow one right there and uh, you know what like that actually once I added the yellow it actually don't look that bad it kind of like calmed it down a bit <laughs> oh, that's some bright colors if the yellow calms it down <laughs> oh and here we go this <laughs> snack color sticker i mean that's actually like kind of the color of that thing it's like a red orange Whew. okay let's put that snack sticker back on there put it on this page so yeah you're kind of getting like a double plan with me if you think about it because like i don't know i don't see the point of me and like flipping through the sticker book over and over again so yeah we're just i'm just gonna plan this out Ooh, ooh, okay, so I need these, and you know what? There's that red-orange color again. Um, I didn't add water trackers last time, but seeing that I still have red-orange water trackers, uh, yeah, I guess you gotta go. So we're just gonna put this on the page as well. In one weird way, I wish I would have put it on the other side in front of breakfast so that I would spread out that red-orange, but eh, whatever. Too late now. It's going on the page. <laughs> 
like I said, passion planner, it is more of my functional planner. I just use the stickies to use them. So, okay. So, I'm going to do the same border trick that I did with the little circles to begin with. I'm going to use these as my header boxes. So, yeah. And you know what? I kind of dig it because I got that green and that red orange side by side. And again, it's going to give me two days worth. So I'm just going to go ahead and just start trimming off this extra here. And just going to trim around. It doesn't have to be perfect just because the background of the page itself is white. So it does kind of like blend in once you put the sticker on the page. So let's see here. We're going to get this off here, here too. And set that down. Sticker trash everywhere. Like actual sticker trash. <laughs> and okay, let's go ahead and find our workout stickers. Which, man, that page is almost killed. Okay, so here we go. Um, My god, like what am I working with this week? <laughs> which this workout program has been going really great. Like I will have to admit, this is probably like... This is probably the most enjoyable, you know, to <laughs> workout program I've ever done. Normally, I'm not someone who, like, enjoys this and uh, wants to come back to it. So, the Fit On app so far has been pretty cool. I think there was just one workout last week where I was like, what the heck is this? And I was disappointed by it. So, um, but, I mean, it at least gives you the chance. Like, it will say, like, hey, these are the workouts we think for you, for your goal. But you also have the chance of picking one yourself and it just kind of like supplements it into your program. And it's free. I mean, they keep trying to get me to buy a premium version. I'm not quite sure what the actual perks are because I don't really need it. Uh, the free version of it is enough. <laughs> so I'm pretty, I'm pretty satisfied with it. I get to search up whatever workouts I want and I press play and it goes. <laughs> And I'm already feeling results in, I'm going to say mainly, like, thighs, like upper thighs. I guess that is the thighs, isn't it? Oh, yeah, you can tell I know what I'm doing. Um, <laughs> there's definitely a lot more, uh, I don't know, room in my jeans, I guess. <laughs> Thank God, again, like, that was so uncomfortable. Um, so, yeah, I got a lot of room there. Uh, I'm also, I also don't feel like, um, like my bra is up in my armpit no more. So heck yeah. And that's after seven days and I'm still eating cupcakes. <laughs> so, yeah. I'm going to have to say like, this is, this is going well. I kind of like, I'm kind of scared today is Monday. So I do have to like measure myself and do all that. Kind of terrified to see that, but then again, like, I'm not really, I don't know. The only reason why I was keeping measurements was so that I could, like, track the progress. But, like, as I said before, like, I started it just because my clothes, like, I couldn't do the clothes. Like, it hurt. It hurt to get dressed. I mean, it mentally hurts to get dressed to go to work, but, like, it physically hurt to get dressed, too. And I didn't like that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we got a major today. Uh, okay, so let's see here. We're going to get back to using some more of these, uh, what, what, what did I call them? Gugis flowers? <laughs> I'm so sorry, guys. I promise you, like, my, my plan with me and my happy planner probably aren't as horrible to watch, but... Like I said, I gotta use some stickers. I have to. And yeah, I know it seems funny that I have like my spending on the same page, which seems to be like all fitness themed. <laughs> but this is the only place where I have to keep track of all my spending. Yes, I do have like a little skinny mini that I keep. I mean, at least he's skinny and he's mini. But yeah, I have a skinny mini <laughs> that I keep track of all my spending um but again like that's why I like this planner because this is like as you saw my handwriting's not the best 
so I can quickly jot down things and I don't have to worry about what it looks like if anything's misspelled. Like, this is my rough draft for all of my planners. <laughs> so I just chicken scratch it on and then when I go to actually work in my happy planners, which I love and adore, um, yeah, like I can make it all pretty and fancy looking. So, yeah, like, so, I mean, yeah, I mean, I'm going to have my spending in here. It's It has my daily log in her, okay? Like, you saw when I wake up and go to bed, and then you see that I nap for probably like 20 hours on Saturday and Sunday to recuperate. <laughs> oh, God, okay, so, uh, with this being Monday, we're going to make this the uh, check-in measurement day, so... I need to find some stars, which, I mean, there's stars on this page. Uh, I kind of want something to cover up that, uh, what, what do they call that? The free space to grow or whatever it is. Is that what they're calling that? Yeah, free space to grow. Okay, so I need to get something to cover that up along with a white backing because something tells me I'm going for a quote sticker because I'm just not seeing anything. Like, you think with this being the fitness sticker book, they would have, like, a, uh, I don't know, like a measurement sticker? <laughs> and, oh my god, guys, look, it's that red-orange color. <laughs> uh, and, I mean, it does have, like, three of my favorite things. So, yeah, I get to eat, sleep, and repeat. <laughs> I should just get a cross-out sticker and cross-out run. <laughs> Yep, fitness planner of someone who doesn't like exercise. <laughs> I'm just trying to keep it real. I am. I mean, my God, I wish that I didn't, like, need to. But apparently the pants told me I did. So if I want to eat what I want to eat, I must do it. <laughs> I love them cupcakes, I do. Okay, so let's see here. That's that trick that I was telling you about for like ever ago. And yeah, I think I'm just ripping this sucker off. Which I see. <laughs> this sticker book is so old that like the stickies are starting to get very difficult to get out of the book. I don't know if that's something that happens like as the sticker books age. So yeah, I, I noticed that I fight with this one more than I do with the newer books. So, let's go ahead and put that on. You know what? I'm, I might. I mean, I might just cross out run. You never know. You might see the flip through of it next week and be like, what? <laughs> so, okay. We can do this. Let's get those stars back. Try to organize this sticker mess that we got going on. <laughs> and, you know, they do have red and orange star stickers. Heck, yeah, like, let's just keep on, keep on. Like, we can keep using these. <laughs> this is going to be the most fiery spread I've ever made. <laughs> oh, boy. Okay, let's see. We're just going to alternate them. So, I'm thinking this one isn't orange. It looks a little bit lighter. Ooh, yeah, and it's definitely noticeable when you put it up next to that red so, uh, big difference between those two. You can't really tell when it's on the sheet. Okay, let's see here. I think this is a red one. Is this a red one? And, okay. So, I got one for the actual weight. Then I have arms, waist, and I guess this is my thighs. I can't remember if I actually wrote down thighs on the last one or did I just term it as legs? Like, I pretty, yeah, I just wrote down legs. Um, yeah, I really wasn't in that, like, doing that. But see, that's, that's what I'm going to be doing here. Minus the whole goal part. I pretty much know what my goal is. I'm just going to be tracking the measurements from here on out. Um, yep. <laughs> so, let's see here. I pretty much got this one taken care of. So, I just need to find something to put in that free space, free space to grow. I mean, they give you a list of things that you could write in there. It's just, I don't know. Like, I, I can't do the words. 
And it gives me another reason to use stickies. So, you know, I'm digging that think positive one. Because, yeah, Tuesdays, normally I call them terrible Tuesdays. So, maybe we'll do the think positive and maybe I could try to use, like, another one of these flower stickers. Kind of show you how, like, I kind of throw them on the edge of the paper and get, like, a double use out of them. Even though I don't know why I would want a double use out of these things, but... Uh, yeah, for demonstration purposes, I think that's what we're going to do. Okay, so... Mm. <sighs> yeah, the answer is... <laughs> Let's see here, I need this white label paper first. Uh, I think this is thin enough over here on this side, so this will help me too when I'm chopping up these little circle stickers later on in the week. So I'm going to go ahead and jack this side up since it's thinner. And those words are pretty much tiny anyways. So um, let's trim off some white label paper. <laughs> so, <laughs> and it's so small I can't even hold on to it. Um, okay. And then this is the fun part too. Because when it does fall like that, you're like, I don't know what side is sticky. So, once you get this off, you just pretty much hold it, and whichever one sticks to your thumb is the one you're keeping. And there you go. Just slap that on there, okay? So, free space to grow is no more. Throw that back over. And let's find these things again. And God, I wish I knew the names of some of these things. <laughs> I don't even know the names. God, these things scare me. They do. <laughs> I am definitely like a cutesy, like, illustration doodle, um, seasonal, I guess, type sticker person. Like, I, I, don't, I don't know what this is. I, I really don't. But, um, mm, which one do I want that I could just cut in half that I'd be like, okay, that might actually look pretty cool. So, um, Let's grab this Gigi's one. <laughs> oh god, like what, what is this thing? Um okay, so I'm thinking like right about there. Then that way like I still have writing room. So I'm gonna show you how like you can decorate at a quote and still have some journaling area. So this is gonna be my Think positive area. Hey, it's Tuesday. You have off tomorrow. So basically, I created two short work weeks in one. I work Monday, Tuesday, have off Wednesday, work Thursday, Friday, and then I go home again for two more days. <laughs> That's a good week. <laughs> um, yeah, so, which, why this sucker won't cut? Like, it really doesn't want to give up on itself. So, um, and you know what? Like, whenever I cut that in half, it actually doesn't... I don't know. It looks more appealing to me whenever I cut it in half. I still don't know what that thing is. If you know what any of these are, like, leave it down in the comments. Uh, I don't know. And, oh my god. Like, look at him. He actually goes really good with that. And it gives me writing room. See, that's that writing room I was talking about. So, huh. Two stickers I never really would have thought of using. And, yeah, you know what end result of this? Like, I'm going to have to say, like, this actually looks semi-decent. It's not something I would have come up with to be like, yeah, I'm going to make my planner is super gorgeous like uh, that but I'm gonna have to say hi baby bird how are you oh he knows planning time is almost done he's trying really hard to stay out of the frame such a good kiddies um but yeah like these aren't really choices I would have like picked to like actually create a planner spread with but I mean they did pretty good I'm, I'm gonna have to say guys it's not horrible <laughs> all right honey so like get, get your kitty tush out of the frame here like we we need to finish up here oh i love that tail look at it look at perfect it's perfect oh yes okay <laughs> okay
Okay, so yeah, I used the, uh, okay, now I normally do use the gold star quotes. I didn't use that at all in this one. And then I used the original mini fitness sticker book in the fun florals. Those are mainly the books that I'm trying to use up and just pretty much clear out my sticker stash so I can make room for the new ones. And again, they kind of give you a slow flip through of like how I'm using this and see like some days, some days you do skip and you got to write about it and document it. And I just realized I didn't write in the number of minutes for this. And that has really been helping a lot. Like that's been a big difference. Uh, just instead of writing down like, hey, I need to work out, write down it's going to take me 15 minutes to work out. And it makes you scheduling your day like you schedule it differently when you actually see how long it's going to take to do something. So that has really helped with my procrastination too. And yeah, you can see some days are neater than others. Other days look like complete chicken scratch. And I mean, I don't know, like with this being a little tiny planner, it is pretty versatile and you could pretty much get it to set up however you need it to be. So yeah, I mean, that's, that's it guys. Like I hope that this helps you if you're new to bullet journaling or starting a passion planner daily. And I just, yeah, I'm going to close out by saying thank you so much. I greatly appreciate it. And um, just have a wonderful week, guys. Thank you so much.